Hey everybody, it's Frank from Motivate. I have another update for you. We have now gone from this to this. Let me show you. As we can see, the car is pretty much fully warmed up. It's temperature gauge is where it should be. And we have a hot idle of about 650 RPM because right over here is the latest version of my mini dash gauges I'm making for the G37. So the engine coolant temperature is 87 degrees Celsius and that's coming from the CAN bus. The engine oil temperature is 71 Celsius. That's also coming from the CAN bus. The air fuel ratio is coming from the CAN bus, but I'm basically am emulating like an elm 327 and asking for an obd service mode one for the air fuel ratio there and that's actually just for bank one it's easy enough to ask for bank two but i just wanted to get one working and then of course the engine oil pressure which is currently 25 psi is coming from my bluetooth server which i have set up right here and the only reason it's in the car it will belong underneath the hood, probably next to the battery in the battery box. But for right now it's here, it just makes it easy if I need to do any updates. So let's just have a look at the gauge here. We'll just rev it a bit. So gauges are nice and responsive. They, uh, in my mind, they look nice and uh, it's, it's working really, really well. So I'm very happy with that. So just wanted to give you a quick update on the progress and uh, I'm going to be adding another, oh, I don't know, 16 or so data items here, maybe another four pages. And um, then we can sort of cycle through and pick what you want because I've got some neat stuff I've found on the CAN bus that I think some of you folks out there are really going to um, enjoy watching. You know, for example, how about, wouldn't you like to know your front wheel torque split compared to the rear? Well, uh, that's on the CAN bus and I found it. So that will be one of the gauges I will add. And that's actually exactly how the GTR does it. All that data is on the CAN bus and you just need to uh, find it, decode it and display it. So that's what I want to show there. So I do have some testing I need to do as we get a little bit further. And I've got some volunteers lined up for that. So that's great. And uh, hopefully I can have a kit together in the spring time frame, which would be wonderful. But I can tell you, Right now for me, it is such wonderful peace of mind knowing my engine oil temperature and my engine oil pressure. Because that way, as soon as that changes out of the usual, out of the normal range, I know I may have a galley gasket starting to go. And that's the time to fix it. Not once you get the code of, you know, the P0011, I think it is, the cam phasing issue. Um, we can catch it before any that of that happens um, and again it is kind of neat to see the actual engine coolant temperature because with the factory gauge from 70 to 105 celsius the needle doesn't move but guess what when you're driving in traffic or you get the air conditioning on uh, the engine coolant temperature does change and it's nice to know exactly what that is anyways that's all for now i just want to give you a quick update and uh, I've got more work to do and I'm going to get on it right after this video. Thanks everybody. Bye-bye.